Welcome back to Waffle TV, sponsored by West Beer. I'm Russ Jennings, and this morning I'm with Carrie Ann Wilde, who's brought her show, Here's Connie, to This Is Fringe. Now, how's the, how's the show been going so far? It's going good. Um, I've had about 15 in each day. I've had one good review from Broadway Baby, so that was nice. Um, really good feedback, and I've learned a hell of a lot. I can, I can imagine, because this is your first year at The Fringe, isn't it? Yeah, first year. Um, I was produced as an 80-minute production back in November, but I decided to strip it back and come independently um, and take all the skills and throw myself in at the deep end. So I think it's worked. Yeah, this must be phenomenally stressful, because it's just yourself, and it's 12. You've been running since the, the 12th yeah. until the end of The Fringe, next Monday. Saturday. Next Saturday. Oh, this Saturday. Wow. And I understand last year you got a you got a first from the University West of Scotland okay. from musical theatre. Now, um, congratulations! But has that do you think do you think that's helped with with everything that's going on this year? It did because at the University of West of Scotland, the course you got to do producing, directing, you got to do acting, and then in the final year you had to pitch for a theatre space. Okay. So I pitched to do a one woman show, and then it got put forward. So you got to do so many different things as well as doing your dissertation. Um, so yeah, even though it was a musical theatre course and some people might be a bit snobbish and think, yeah, what can you do? Um, you did a lot in the course. I can imagine that did carry quite a lot of weight as well. Yeah, it did. <laughs> it was pretty stressful. And you're originally from the Highlands, you say, up in Aviemore. Now, and you, you work with lots of communities there as well. And do you put on shows there? And is this, is this a, will this be a regular thing coming down to Edinburgh? I've done two previews up there with Here's Connie before I came, which was great fun. And the Newtmore Drama Group, they sponsored me to come down as well, which was really good. Um, so when I go back, I'll be working with them to put on different nights because there's, it's lacking in the rural areas. And they've got some good setups in the village halls and stuff. Yeah. And they love it as well. So. I can imagine, yeah, because they always have these sort of community halls everywhere, don't they? And will you be taking, so you'll be taking Here's Connie around the Highlands, basically? Yeah, I hope to. In the local areas, and um, there's Boat of Garden that has a nice place, Newton Moore Village Hall, and probably Abbey Moore. They have quite a big theatre, okay. so yeah, why not? See how that goes. And so th this year, how how has it? Have you felt it's gone so far in general? It's going better than I thought. Um, it took me a couple of days to get into things, but I did have a week beforehand where I was going to seminars and trying to network that way, so that helped. Um, and just I've learned a lot it's very much word of mouth down here so you really have to put yourself out there and get rid of any shyness and just go for it and basically sell yourself for all you can and I hope can imagine it is incredibly competitive as well it does get quite competitive but it's really supportive at Judy's Inn there's some fantastic companies who are in the same position their first time and they all try to support each other and go and see each other's shows and so that helps as well and do you think you'll be coming back next year? I would, but I think I would come in a company and do a bigger production because it does get lonely <laughs> when you're by yourself. Um, but yeah, I would definitely come again in a company and possibly look at the free fringe as well. So fingers crossed that, that, that we'll see you back next year. <laughs> Brilliant. Well, thank you very much for speaking to us today and break a leg for the rest of your performances. Thank you. And remind us, what time again? It's 2.10 at the Jury's Inn every day. This is Ross Jennings from Waffle TV, sponsored by West Beer.